welcome again today we will learn how to make joins in quick site it is very simple but uh, i i will explain it in step by step uh, first of all let us see our base data and identify the fields or column where we can make joins and their properties so uh, let us start with our sample data as i already uploaded in excel sheet it is just a quick uh, go through of uh, data uh, so we can uh, make this presentation or video very fruitful for you and uh, let's see the columns and identify we are going make joins between three sheets basically i earlier told i explained my um, last couple of videos uh, and the sheets uh, and uh, its data about its all the data let's say start with the its order sheet and it contains the information order returns and the peoples in different regions joins with orders means the people perform these orders so uh, first of all uh, we see here uh, the region column it contains all the information about the region and there is no any other field in this uh, sheet so we will try to identify this uh, the same column or the same fields in our order data set uh, so uh, let's navigate the whole column we can uh, see here is a, a region so the region in order and the region in people sheet has the same name but the same name is not mandatory for the join but uh, the data type should be the same you can see here in the different regions like uh, canada western us western europe and some of others and in order you can see here all the information for the region so we can make a join between order and people as we identified a field of name region has the same data type as in order and the third sheet is returned here we can directly see the two columns are matched with the order the region we already identified for the people we can make a relationship between order and region and the order id it's the unique uh, number of order ids in order sheet and in return we can make join two joins region with region and order id with the order id so uh, let's go back to our quick site and uh, see how we can uh, implement the joins there before uh, yes before we start the joins in quick site implement uh, joining uh, starting the implementation of joins uh, just look at some concept of uh, joins in uh, databases join in uh, any type of uh, db relevant tools like power bi quick site 
and uh, mysql and oracle these joins are uh, same Im implementation are the same in all the tools so let's read some uh, concepts of the join uh, actually the there are four major type of joins first of all you can s uh, see on the screen inner join left join right join and full join inner join return record that have match the value in both tables the and the left join return all the records from the left table and the match record from the right table in this join uh, data property will be given to the right table left table and second in the right table and the third type of the join is right join return all the rows from right table and the match record from the left table it is uh, the reverse shape of uh, the left join and the last and uh, last one is full join return all the records when there is a match in either left or right so these are the four types used in quick sight for the conceptual clarity uh, we just only navigate to the next slide it will clearly elaborate you about the joins so the inner join you can see here the left join the right join and the full outer join so basically these are the four types of join available in a quick side let's start its its implementation Bef before i just told about all the conceptual data identification and the theory of the joins and then the graphical representation of the joins so now we are in the implementation phase uh, in the quick side uh, we just need to perform some steps to upload the sheets and uh, make a join between them I selected a field order sheet already imported in my quick site after loading we just only select the sheet inside the excel file people I just refresh my page here you can see the both sheets are imported and I'm just going to show you the join as we identified in the uh, people sheet and the other sheet we can only make a join on uh, one field uh, because the person field is not available in uh, orders so we just select a region you can see here the sheet name people and the order and both the uh, sheets contains the same field region with the same data types uh, I am using here the left chain actually uh, because uh, order has a lot of uh, transactions and the people has lesser 
table so I place it on the top because uh, the huge transactions are available in order in the same case uh, the order return I attached here with the left chain by using the order ID as we uh, discussed earlier we can multiple fields join uh, based on our requirement let's uh, uh, let's add the region and uh, the region ID we can use both the fields but right now uh, we have it is not required so we can just only we can uh, remove here by using the cross sign and the order ID so here is uh, you can see the inner join actually if uh, we use the inner joins then order ID only include the records uh, belongs to the uh, peoples and uh, ex exclude all the records are not matching between people and order so we using the left join because we uh, want to show all the records of orders and orders attached with region by using the people and the same left chain will be using for order and the return so our data requirement is to use the left chain so in this data model we are using the uh, left chain and uh, uh, we you can use uh, right full and inner based on your requirement so that's it is there any question please post in my video i will reply you uh, see you for the next video uh, on the quick side bye